Buenas noches, teacher. Ya completé la plataforma. Uh, gracias, Mr. Carlos. Thank you very much. Okay. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? Hello, hello. Yes, Good evening. Okay. Well, let's start. Let's start another English class. Okay. Another English class. All right. Today, yesterday, we practiced the indirect question. Tema que si les ha gustado. También el vocabul vocabulary. Good. All right. Ahora, okay. ¿Alguien recuerda cuál era la descripción de mix? Mix. Mix. All the raw materials are poured I'm sorry? in a batch. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. All the raw materials are poured, poured Pour. In a in a batch and uh, mix it. Okay. Do you know what the uh, raw material raw material is? Do you know what? It's an indirect question. Una, una pregunta indirecta. Do you know what raw material is? Saben qué significa raw material? Materia prima. Materia prima. Excelente. Very good. Okay. Uh, pour. Do you know what? Esto significa vertir. Okay. Algún líquido. Okay. Vertir. Okay, uh, what is quality control? Quality control. What is quality control? A sample is sent to be analyzed. 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 Analyzed to ensure. It meets specification. Meet specification. Excellent. Very good. What is filter? Filter. After the bat is approved. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. After okay. the pack, the bat is mm -hmm. approved. Approved? Approved. The shampoo is poured okay. in the right amount in into the uh, the no sé qué, no, empty no sé, no sé la palabra. empty empty bottle 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 okay excellent okay uh... What is capping? Okay, esto es conviene de tapa. Capping. Uh, the bottles are moved the another uh, machine uh, that puts a can of every bottle and trees the inside. Okay, bottle are moved another machine that puts a cap on very. Okay, good. Okay, leveling. Uh, the company your uh, belt days the bottles uh, to the machine where the levels with ingredients and the brand may is true for them. Okay, ingredients. 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 Okay, excellent. Packing. What is packing? And the bottles are put into boxes and are ready to to be sent to the stores. Ok, excelente, very good, muy bien, excelente. Bueno, también el día de ayer realizamos 
una actividad. Ahora vamos a realizar otra actividad de speaking, ¿ok? Para ir ya ingresando al nivel eh, un poquito más avanzado, ¿verdad? ¿ok? Para que puedan ir practicando el speaking part. Ok, eh, in the previous class, you create... Ok, I found... Uh, we had a conversation... Un segundo para abrirla. Oh. Ok, give me a second. Quiero compartir con ustedes la actividad de ayer. Ok. You need to... eh, muchas gracias, Mr. Carlos, por la, ya completar sus actividades. Solamente era un recordatorio para okay. que no se le fuera a acumular demasiadas gracias. tareas. Sí, gracias. Teacher, ¿hasta qué unidad va acumulada? Hasta la unidad 3. Tengo entendido. Así, es. Yo, usted Así es. Sin okay. embargo, es de felicitar a varios compañeros que ya tienen, actual, ya tienen completadas las cuatro unidades. Muchas gracias. Ok. Muchas gracias. Okay, good. Well, eh, I guess, yeah. Esta fue la actividad del día de ayer. For example, eh, ¿cómo podría comenzar la historia? Alguien que comience la historia using the first image. Any volunteer to begin the story? I'm sorry. Me teacher. I'm sorry. Hello, hello. Me. Okay. Go ahead, please. This story is about one day my brother Eduardo was on his way to work. Last Monday, he got uh, a lay, didn't have breakfast, and ran off. On the way to the bus stop, he had an um, accident, and he is sleeping, and couldn't catch the boots, and the sun tied, waiting for the next bus. On the way to work, he pumped traffic a river late for work. Um, the box was waiting for him at the entrance, carry all the corresponding section. Excellent, very good. Very good, Miss. Thank you very much for your participation. You know, si tenemos más voluntarios. Para la, la creación de la historia utilizando las imágenes. Um, yo tengo una pequeña historia, Tita. Si no okay. la completemos. Go ahead, Miss. Yes, este, yes crean su story. And uh, good, mor good morning, employer. It's very fast because words. And there are no traffic modes. You wake up early, chaps. The time is unlated. I walk early, go very fast. I finish from from fast. Um, in work, in office. Es una pequeña historia que yo te hice en unas imágenes. Okay. And what happened at the end of the story? ¿Qué pasó al final? What happened at the end? Um, que bueno, que llegó tarde ay, al trabajo y él este, se cayó. Bueno, yo, en caso mío. Por en inglés, en inglés, en inglés. Espérame. Uh, permítame. I, I go, I was going very fast and the fear for a route fast. 
in the traffic for for traffic modes uh and the chat in the time um because uh a workplace yes of photo okay excellent very good okay another volunteer who wants to share with us the story that you created yesterday thank you mister go ahead please Today Ricardo woke up late because last night he went partying with the neighbor. When he saw the time, he ran to the bus stop. But with running, he slipped on banana spill, so he couldn't, couldn't reach the bus, and this was a lot of traffic because. There was crash. When, when Ricardo arrived at the office, his ball told him to take today off, but that he was going to do it. Finish? Okay. Hey, what happened at the end, mister? With the time, what happened with him? Uh, it was. I'm sorry. Him, the, the bus. ¿Qué pasó con el bus? The bus told him to take the off. To okay. The, but that he was going to the look it. Okay. Good. Excellent. Thank you, Mister. Thank you very much for your help. Okay. Oh, dos voluntarios más. Okay. Two volunteer. Okay, what happened? With Okay, go ahead, miss. In this morning, I woke up late because I didn't hear the alarm 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 clock. Uh, then took a shower and got dressed quickly. Then I have run to take the bus, but it left me anyway. Okay. <laughs> I wait, wait, waited for okay. the next bus and found a lot of traffic and when i go to the work my boss was angry your boss your you ah your boss okay your boss was my angry boss because, was angry yes. because uh, you you came late yes good excellent okay and the last volunteer please the last volunteer Thank you. Go ahead, please. Uh, yesterday, it was the worst day in my life. Okay, what happened? My alarm didn't work and I woke up late. I had to run to the bus station and I had an accident. I destroyed my briefcase. Eventually, I missed the bus and I had to wait 30 minutes for the next bus. At that time, I got stuck in the traffic jam, and I was there for 45 minutes. Okay. Finally, I arrived to my job uh, late, and my boss fired me. Excellent. Excellent. Thank you very much for your participation. Bueno, muy bien. Eh... Ok, ahora vamos a contestar esta pregunta. Ok. No sé si pueden visualizar la, la presentación. Yes. Sí, teacher. Sí. Yes. Bueno, en este caso vamos a contestar estas preguntas y eh, las vamos a discutir con nuestros compañeros. Ok. Eh, take a screenshot, please. Okay, 
primero lean las preguntas, después crean las respuestas y después traten de eh, decir las respuestas sin leer. Trato, ¿ok? Ok, here we go. ¿Cuál le pregunté? Ahorita les comparto. Gracias. Bye. Puede abrir otra hoja para ir escribiendo la respuesta ahí. En un note. Quiero ver qué dicen. Esa no la ven, vean, sí. No, ahorita solo estoy viendo la, El la, Word. las preguntas. Ajá, sí, va. Ah, pues aquí la voy a ir escribiendo y, y en el Word, en, el, en un blog de notas aparte. Ok. Bien. Quiero ver qué dice la primera. Do you remember? ¿Tú recuerdas alguna acerca de una tu personalidad? personalidad. Cuando eras niño o, o así de quién? Sí, sí, sí. ¿Qué le ponemos? Yes. No. <risa> Bueno, no sé si las tenemos que responder individual y después compartirla. Ahí está el teacher, te preguntarle. <risa> las preguntas son individuales y después las compartimos. O exactly. Es una... First of all, okay. work individual and then share your answer with your classmates. Okay. Okay. Qué triste. Bueno, recordar por los tiempos infantiles.
I how I don't have a lot of friends. Oh, I didn't have. Um, I I very selective with my friends. In my case, I I have friends. A uh, per percent only men, but the girls more or less. I don't know why, but all the time is it the same. I have my, more friends men than women. And you? Because we are more loyal. Maybe. I don't know. As a friend, the... as a friend, we are more loyal. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. Um, okay. Um, okay. Um, okay. I think Proverbs. I have um, for workers. Female and she or is a boss. She says uh, she never uh, believes about the the friend and family with men with woman. He says he doesn't believe on that. Uh -huh. He doesn't believe because she's I don't know. She thinks on the the uh, friends on all the time have a a relationship more. Más allá de una amistad sincera. Okay, so he says there is no a true intention. Ah uh, yes, a true intention. Okay. Good. And that is going. Guillermo, and your teacher, did you have a lot of friends? Actually, have of I have just we have some some friends some friends for example i have four friends four friends that we grew up together since we were since we were child i met them when i was in kindergarten my mm -hmm. friend okay and we are now we are adults we are 30 32 20 20 29 we are in the same age mm -hmm. and we are still in touch, in touch. For example, we go, we meet in a house and we see the kids, okay, the daughters, sons, and we spend time together. Mm -hmm. And yeah, only four friends that I know them since a long time ago. Four friends. Mm -hmm. The kinder, I, I, I didn't see again. Okay. <laughs> and the the school and the first grade to nine. 
I only have two, four, no, four, five, five friends. I saw two. Um, Sandra, the, it's not the same. Nitokaya. Mm. And Cesar, Marcial, and Juventino, four. But the mm. other only saw a long time. And the bachelor, bachelor, as it's pronounced, bachelor. 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 I I see only two. The others I lost. The the friends. And and the work I I have a uh, my cluster. Uh, we have one. Only four. We we eat together. We we go to the beach. Um, the volcano. We have a lot of trips together. Only four. I need a sec. But we have 20, 20, 20, 20 or 25 years net. Hello, hello. Hello. Vamos a mover. Cuatro. Only I speak in the others. <laughs> they don't. They are they are shy. <laughs> Tell me the next question, pero but work on your answer. Work on your answer because later we're gonna share all the answers in the main room. Okay. Uh, uh, what were some embarrassing situations when you were a child? I don't remember. Ah, yes. You remember. When, yes, I remember. When I was in the kindergarten, my my sister. Your sister. What happened with your sister? No, my sister. Uh, what do you say? Disfrazó. I'm sorry. Disfrazar. A uh, custom. She custom. The la chilindrina. Hmm. I don't forget that. <laughs> you don't forget it. I don't forget it. Yes. Uh, uh, the next uh, where you are I guess I was a good student in the high school uh, I didn't get good grades <laughs> I passed but I I worked to my homework every day. All right. And I, the only, I didn't like math. I don't know why. <laughs> I didn't. Mm, numbers, maybe. Numbers, yes, I didn't like. But, but you like books. Yes, I, I like it book, but math is no. It is your weakness. Yes. yes in my and the weakness. books are your strengths. Mm -hmm. And mm. I like, what did you like about school? I, 
I don't know. Maybe um, when they end the class. Okay, and how was your personality when you were a kid? I'm very quiet. i very obedient. Obedient, okay. Obedient, and I, all the time, I, I homework, I, I work at home. But i very obedient. 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 Very good. Okay. Vamos a... Yeah. Aún no terminamos, teacher. No problem.
Por cualquier cosa, si este no contesto es porque me ha sacado el Zoom, porque aquí viene una gran tormenta ahorita. Así está aquí. Igual. ¿Ya terminaron algo? Sí. Sí. Yes. Sí. Sí, yes, 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 que sí. Yes, yes. Comencemos entonces. Okay. Antes de que nos quedemos fuera. ¿Cómo va? Okay. The first, do you remember anything about your personality when you were a child? Um, yes. Yes. I was she a friend, a friend. What? Timida, a friend. A friend, okay. <clears throat> I am, I was very quiet and obedient, obedient. Okay. <laughs> I want to quiet too. <laughs> ¿Qué fue? Hola, hola, a mí me hablaban. Yes. Yes. Ando, ando perdida, lo siento. No he terminado. Solo en la primera, que conteste la primera, nada más la que ya uh, pienso. Uh, when I was a child, I was very serious and unfriendly because I went out selling with my mother and we come back very late. Ya ve, ya casi todas las contestó. Yes. <laughs> no me faltan. Ok, the number one, the number two. Were you good at uh, making friends? Mm. No. I I die in this in this case. <laughs> I um uh, I wasn't have I wasn't have friends, very friends, a lot of friends, or making friends. 
In my case, no, I wasn't because I was shy. And for me, it was difficult to make friends. Mm -hmm. And you, Rosy? I, uh, en la dos vamos, ¿verdad? Yes. I'm making friends. Yes. Uh, yes, at school. If I made a lot of friends, mm -hmm. we like to play during recess. Okay. The three, did you have, no. How did you make friends when you did friends? <laughs> In my case, I met friends the most of the time when I played with with their or, or playing something. Uh, did, say, did you get good grades? Es nota o es grado? Nota. Um, Yo sigo, ¿verdad? Sí. En la tres. I made friends as we played and did chores. Yo creo que así me salió esa palabra. Cuando jugaba y hacía tareas. Did homework. And play and home. Entonces es homework. Ajá, homework. And did homework. Mm -hmm. oh. Then, do you have a lot of friends? I no. only have about two friends. Mm. In my case, Yes, I had many friends. Um, no sé cómo poner. Según iba avanzando. ¿Cómo le digo? Según iba Según... creciendo. Ajá. I don't know. Creo, a medida va creciendo, grow up. Eh, sí, pero no sé cómo poner. Solo puse... Solo I have many friends. As it grows. A medida va creciendo. As it grows. Con una S. Grows. Eh, G -R -O no, no, no. As, as, as con as, una S. Sí, con una. It. As it Grow. Grow. Solamente así, sin S. G-R-O-W-S. -E ah, me faltó la S. I only have, in my case, I only have the, the high school. ¿Hasta dónde llega la high school? Nice. O sea, noveno. 
Lo de no, porque el otro es bachiller. I only have two, two friends to the third grade to batch, batch, I, bachelor. I was just a pronouncer. Bachelor. Bachelor. And the other friends I have in the world and my neighbor, I don't have many friends. Okay. <laughs> because I I like to stay alone uh, in the house. I I when I was a child I had maybe about ten friends, something like that. Hello. Hello. Okay. Well, uh, now that you practice the questions, okay, you practice with your classmates, it's time to uh, talk. Okay. It's time to talk. Okay, so there you go. I'm gonna share a screen, the screen. Okay, the first question. Do you remember anything about your personal, your personal, oh, your personality when you were a child? Yes, teacher. I remember yes. I, was I was shy and quiet, very quiet. You are, you used to you used to be what shy, shy and quiet. Yes, shy and quiet. Okay, good. Um, another another answer. Another volunteer. Uh, I am very quiet and obedient when I was a child. You are what? I'm sorry. Quiet and obedient. Obedient, obedient. okay. Obedient. Good. Excellent. Another volunteer. Do you remember anything about your personality when you were a child? Uh, me, teacher. Go ahead, please. When I was a child, I was I was very serious mm -hmm. and unfriendly because I went out selling with my mother and we came back very late all right excellent very good excellent okay uh, another participation please go ahead i am remember uh quite colors i'm sorry I am remember a uh, quite curious. I'm sorry, oh. I, I can't understand the last part. I am uh -huh. remember. Okay, okay. Quite I rem no, I, I, yeah, yo recuerdo, I remember. Uh, I remember a uh, uh, quite curious. Curious. <laughs> yes. Curious, okay. You you were very curious, okay. And what else, Miss? ¿Qué más? What else? Only teacher. Only that, okay. Excellent. Okay, let me see. Uh, were you good at making friends? 
Were you good at making friends? No, teacher, I wasn't because I was shy. And for me, it was difficult to make friends. For you, it was difficult to make friends. Okay. Good. Uh, because you were a child. And do you think was another uh, interruption, another barrier? Maybe um, I don't, I didn't like uh, speak a lot with you the didn't people. Like, okay. Good. Okay, let me see. Another volunteer. Were you good at making friends? Go ahead, please. Uh, no, I was uh, very good at making friends. Why not? Why not? Por qué no? Mm. Era, ¿cómo se dice callada? <laughs> you, uh, you, was, you were quiet. You were quiet. En ese caso oh. se respondría, I was. I was quiet. 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 Very good. Next question. How do you make friends? Well, you didn't have friends. Um, what did you enjoy doing with your friends? What did you enjoy doing with my with your friend? I remember I did enjoy well. I enjoyed uh, playing soccer, eating some tortillitas with lemon, and also we enjoy going to the forest to run and cycling. What did you enjoy doing with your friend? And also watching television. Okay, Power Rangers, Dragon Balls, and all those kind of TV show program. How about you? What did you enjoy doing with your friends? I play onion plucker. I'm sorry? I play onion plucker. I play onions. Ah, okay. Arranca la cebolla. Okay. Okay, okay. Good. Okay, you enjoy playing, playing games with your friends. What else? Uh, me teacher, I remember, um, I, I remember we did like teacher, así okay. sería. Uh, ¿Qué recuerda? I'm sorry. Uh, Jump and rob. Ah, uh, saltar la cuerda. Okay, jumping the rope. Ah, uh, jumping the rope. Um, some, something in the recess in the school. At the school. En los recesos okay. de la escuela. Good, okay. Uh, what were some embarrassing situations when you were a child? Um, in my case, when didn't let me go out and play with them. Can you repeat it again? Uh, when they didn't. Okay. They didn't. Let... Your parents. La, yes, let me go out and play 
with them. Okay, didn't, didn't let you go out. No la dejaban salir. En ese caso, sí. Yes. Ajá. No me dejaban salir con ellas. Y yo ya había dicho que sí. All right. Okay, so that's why. Uh, so those are embarrassing situations. Okay. Okay, another opinion over there. When my old sister uh, dressed up um, Chilindrina in the, in the kindergarten, I hate. <laughs> when your best, when your, your my sister. Old sister, yes. Your old sister. Mm -hmm. Okay, your older, hermana mayor, older sister. Older sister. Okay, what uh, happened? ¿Qué pasa? ¿Qué pasó ahí? She dressed up. She dressed? She dressed as... Uh, ah, she got dressed? She got dressed as Chilindrina. As Chilindrina, okay. Good. Muy bien. Uh, another volunteer, what were some embarrassing situations when you were a child? I cried a lot in the street, teacher, because <laughs> I, I did a tantrum to my mom. <laughs> and what happened with your with your mom? Uh, uh, my mom uh, crossed the street because she got some fruits and I want to go with, with her. But my mom uh, lead, lead me with my aunt and I cry and cry and cry and and shot out a lot, a <laughs> lot, yes. All right. Okay, thank you. Another volunteer? Another volunteer. Me teacher. Thank you. Yes, teacher. Yes. Sí, teacher. Please. Sí, teacher. And the question. Other the question. I'm sorry, I don't, I don't get it. No lo entiendo, Miss. No sé si el Inter está fallando. No sé si me oye, Ticha. Sí, le escuchamos claro Pero... y fuerte. Ok. No sé cuál. ¿Cuál de las preguntas? En la que estamos ahorita, Miss. What were some embarrassing situations when you were a child? Situation when I a child. Um, embarrassing situation. You were anxious and, and fever in the school. And, they, and that day, I was the clown. The clown. In the school. I embarrassing situation and when you were and seal a chair, I feel in the course that day I was the clover in the school. Okay, thank you. Next question it says, Were you a good student? Were you a good student? Did you? In my case, yes, teacher, I was a good student. Did you have good grades? Yes, excellent grades. Okay, were you always the abanderados? Yes, teacher. <laughs> excellent. Good. Uh, but that was at high school. How about university? Two teacher. Okay, you were you were good at 
you were a good student at the university too. Yes, teacher. Okay, excellent. Okay, any other volunteer? No, about me, Sandra, were you a good student? Yes and no. <laughs> yes and no. Why? Yes, I, I, I don't have a good grades but no i don't i didn't have in the last in the last but i do my homework alone i i was very applicate but um only the math i i have bad notes i don't like i don't like math. Okay, uh, bad grades, not as grades. But bad grades, yes. All right. Excellent. Muy bien. Bueno, let's have another question. Uh, what do you like about school? What do you like about school? In my case, teacher, I, I enjoy the different activities that they did, for example, the family day. Okay, I what, what is that? Uh, it's like a turn. I'm sorry? Like a turn. How do you say turn? Shift? When, yes, the shift. Um, they bought a, a different... Uh, like pupus and tamales and we do we did uh, some some games basketball soccer or another game all right so the family it was like the tournament game como los intramuros mm -hmm. so okay. more or less uh... kind of okay good all right, any other volunteer? What did you like and what di uh, didn't you like about school? Why did you like and what didn't you like? And did you like teacher about school? Uh, in students morning. Hey, to study in the morning. In studying, pardon, in study in the morning. All right, and mm -hmm. the things that you liked? You like, um, you like uh, in school, uh, and I uh, enjoy playing that's me in recepts to eat pupusas, nachos, soda. Okay, you like to eat and drink chips and soda. Ok, Miss eh, Clarixa, algo que debe de eh, trabajar es que a la hora de responder no me tiene que decir you like porque se está refiriendo a usted. Entonces, en ese caso, tiene que decir I like. Ok, no hay que confundir los Ajá, nombres. Perdón. Sí, se le había escrito I like, enjoy. Entonces sería I, I, I like. In the recept. Ajá. And like, I like joy. Sabian Siva. And like, I like enjoy player. And like, and like, me oye. Si, sí, le escuchamos fuerte y claro. El orto. Ah, si. And like, I like joy. I like, and like, and like, and like, enjoy player. In reset, plus me. Okay, thank you. Y to eat, también to, to eat, um, so I, like, I like to eat, pupu, comer pupusas exactly. y nachos. Okay, pupusas and nachos. Good, thank you. 
Okay, okay. well, uh, sure. now we're going to go over a topic that is called uh, the passive, the passive voice. Let me see. Hold on, please. Give me just one minute. Okay. All right, we're going to study this topic that is called the passive voice. Okay, in the passive voice, we're in, we will learn, okay, uh, this structure in which you have to remember the past participle of the verbs, okay? Uh, also the verb to be and the subjects. Okay, I'm gonna share a screen and let me know if you can see the presentation, please. Can you see it? Yes. Okay, yes. we're going to study, we're going to go over the active and passive voice. Vamos a estudiar la voz activa y la voz pasiva. For example, a sad story. Last week, I found a great apartment. The rent was reasonable, that's why. I decided to throw a party the other night. I decided to throw a party the other night. The next day, I was thrown out of it. Of it. The next day, I was thrown out of it. Active or passive. I threw a party the other night. That is active. I did something. I was thrown out of it. Meaning something was done to me. Okay. El, para dar una... Eh, identificar cuando es la voz activa y cuando es la voz pasiva. Pues la voz activa es cuando únicamente la oración está compuesta por el sujeto, el verbo y el eh, complemento. Sin embargo, en la voz activa van a encontrar eh, la, la siguiente estructura. Por ejemplo, eh, va a encontrar el sujeto más el ver to be más el verbo en participio. ¿Okay? Eso es cuando usted dice la casa fue demolida o la casa es demolida. En ese caso, eh, estamos utilizando la voz pasiva, lo cual describe la acción o podemos eh, mover la posición del sujeto. Aquí dice, the passive is formed with the verb to be in the appropriate tense, past participle of the main verb. Como les estaba mencionando, en la voz pasiva está compuesto por el sujeto más el verbo to be, ya sea en pasado o presente, más el verbo en participio. ¿Qué ¿Okay? se recuerdan de los verbos en participio? Ok, bueno. Eh, por ejemplo, el, la voz pasiva es cuando usted dice eh, la casa fue construida por eh, mi abuelo, por ejemplo. Okay. Entonces, esa es una, esa es la voz, la voz pasiva. Bueno. Aquí dice, the terrorist was arrested early this morning. Recordarle, el, la voz pasiva está compuesta por el sujeto más el verbo to be más el verbo en participio. Ok, el verbo, en part, el verbo to be puede variar. Puede ser en pasado, presente o futuro. Dependiendo de cómo esté la voz activa.
Ok, acá está este ejemplo. The terrorist was arrested early this morning. El terrorista fue arrestado temprano esta mañana. Toyota cars are made in Japan. Los carros de Toyota son construidos o son armados o son hechos en Japón. A new class representative will be chosen on Monday. Una clase representativa será escogida el lunes. Okay, these examples show that a passive sentence can be in whatever tense you like. This tense of the verb to be changes to give different tenses in the passive. Okay, estos ejemplos demuestran que la voz pasiva puede ser utilizada ya sea en diferentes tiempos del verb to be. Vamos a continuar. Vamos a repasar las formas del verb to be. Por ejemplo, el presente simple es am, is, or are. The present continuous tense is am, is, are, plus being, ¿verdad? Más el verbo en ing. The present perfect, it is have been or has been. The past simple tense, it is was, either was or where. And so on. Ok, es las que hemos estudiado, pues no hace falta hacer alguna estructura. Pero las que ya estudiamos, por ejemplo, el presente simple, el presente continuo. Eh, por ejemplo, perfect tense. The simple tense, the, past, uh, the present perfect, son estructuras que ya estudiamos y que ya se eh, recordarán, ¿verdad? La forma, la forma del, ¿qué dice? del verb to be. Ok. Do these sentences have the same meaning? ¿Cómo podemos hacer? Que las siguientes oraciones tengan algún significado. The mouse, the mouse was eaten by the cat. Esta es voz, la voz eh, pasiva. The mouse was eaten by the cat. Y la voz activa, the mouse ate the cat. Ok. Al final podemos colocar quién es el que realiza la acción, colocando la preposición by, que significa por. Por ejemplo, eh, Great Expectation fue escrita por Charles Dickens. Great Expectation was written by Charlie Dickens. En esta oración, ¿dónde está ubicado el verb to be? Was. Was. ¿Cuál es el verbo en participio? Written. Right. Written. ¿Por quién, right. fue, right. ¿Por quién fue escrito el libro? Charles Dickens. Charles Dickens. Muy bien. Eh, ¿Cuál es el sujeto de la oración? Great expectation. Great expectation. Ok. Next. Star Wars was directed by George Lucas. ¿Cuál sería...? What is the verb? What is the verb to be? Verb was. Was uh, the past participle. Direct. Okay. Direct. Direct. Okay. Good. The subject. Star Wars. Star Wars. Star Wars. Okay. Star Wars. Intentemos hacer este ejercicio. Recuerden, vamos a utilizar eh, sujeto, el verb to be. En eh, past participle.
Okay, Sorry, did, you, did the, you finish? Sorry, yes, but what is the past participle of the constructor? Uh, ED, constructed. Okay. Thank you. Anytime. Teacher, in the first, uh, in the structure, uh, both passive mm -hmm. first, and the second. I'm sorry? Uh, I, I, I wait to the answer. I'm sorry, I, I, I don't get it. I don't, can you please repeat yes. the question? No, I, I, I wait for the, the answer. Or the okay. Okay, let's let's start. Okay, number one. What do you have in number one? Vamos, ahorita, vamos a ver 
eh, cómo organizar el Passive Voice. Okay. Shampoo. Was. Was. Past participle of test. Tasted. Tested on animals before it. Was sold. It was sold in shops. shops. Okay. Ah. Una vez más. Shampoo was test on animals before it was sold in sh uh, shops. This house was, was built. Was built in 19th century. Mm -hmm. In the, the missing children were found, found, were found, were found, found, were found a safe found and well. Safe and well. Okay, a new bridge was constructed. Was constructed. What's going to take? Constructor. Next year, vamos a ver. Construction. Bueno. Cuando nosotros hicimos en pasado, no importa. Ok. Hicimos en pasado, pero esa sí, la, la última era futuro. No leímos el next year. Solo nos dejamos guiar. Pero, mm. eh, todas las hicimos en pasado. Por ejemplo, shampoo. Was tested, estaba bien. Sin embargo, aquí lo, colo le, lo pudimos sí. también colocar en presente, no hay problema. Was be. Built, porque es el participio de build. Build, built, built. Next. Ahora tenemos que aprender a convertir de activa a pasiva. Ok, vamos a primero identificar. Eh, tenemos, aquí dice, aquí están los pasos para convertir de activa a pasiva. De active a passive voice. The postman delivers the letters at eight. At nine, sorry. Primero tenemos que encontrar... ¿Cuál es el objeto de lo que se está hablando? En este caso, ¿de qué estamos hablando en esta oración? The postman delivers the letters. ¿Qué fue lo que fue a dejar? The letters. The letters. Entonces, the letters lo vamos a colocar al inicio, lo vamos a convertir sujeto. Una vez que ya tengamos identificado el objeto, vamos a colocar el verb to be. Dependiendo en qué tiempo gramatical estemos, así será siempre. Si es pasado, vamos a utilizar was or where. Y si es presente, va a ser is, are, or am. Después, el verbo tiene que ir colocado en eh, participio. En este caso, el verbo es deliver. Lo vamos a convertir a participio y, y dirá deliver. Por ejemplo, dirá the letter are delivered at nine. Las en la primera dice, el postman eh, dejó las cartas o entregó las cartas. Y en la voz activa, las cartas fueron entregadas a las nueve. Ahí podemos agregar, by the postman. By the postman puede ser una opción. Ok, recordar, primer paso, identificar el objeto de qué estamos hablando. Segundo, colocar el verb to be, ya sea en pasado, presente o futuro. Tercero, agregar el participio del verbo, la forma participia. Por ejemplo, vamos a hacer la primera. Eh, ¿Cuál es el, de qué estamos hablando en la primera oración? The suspect. The suspect. Ok, eh, 
Ahora tenemos que colocar el verb to be. ¿En qué tiempo gramatical está hablando la voz activa? En paz. Paz. Entonces, paz. ¿qué vamos a colocar? Was. 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 Participio de arrest. 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 En este caso no va a cambiar porque el, el mismo verbo es en pasado simple y en pasado participio. Pero recordarles que hay verbos que van a cambiar en todas sus formas. Ya sea infinitivo, pasado simple y eh, participio. ¿Por quién fue eh, arrestado? The police. By the police. By the police. By the police. police. ¿Cuándo? Last night. Last night. Last night. Last night. Ok. The suspect. The suspect was arrested by the police last night. Vale, tratamos de hacer el siguiente. ¿De qué estamos sí. hablando? Kim. Kim. I'm sorry. No, no les logro escuchar. ¿De qué estamos hablando? Him. They found him. No. No. ¿Cuál es el objeto? An intensive research. An intensive research. An intensive... Ah, search, I'm sorry. Search. Ahora colocamos el verbo, to be. Was. Was, was porque estamos hablando en pasado. Was. Was. Found, porque no lo cambiamos, porque el mismo pasado simple es el mismo en pasado participio. An, inten an intensive search was found. By, by day. By, bueno, aquí, aquí va a suceder un cambio. Okay. Cuando el sujeto se convierte en objeto, vamos a utilizar eh, este. Them. El object pronouns, los objetos... Uh -huh. Por ejemplo, puede ser by me, by them, by her, by his. Eso lo, voy a, lo vamos a repasar en la siguiente clase. All right. Two detectives question him and church, church him with murder. With murder. Was. Was. Question. Was. Question. Was question. Was question. In charge. In charge. By quién? By two detectives. O podría ser by them. Okay, they will take him to the court later. Y será 
the court will be taken by them today. Sí, tengo una duda y en ese caso entonces se pierde el him en todas. Eh, podría ser the court will be taken by them the court, bueno que si le agregamos him perdería un poquito de sentido, por eso lo dejamos un poquito más simple. Okay. The court will be taken by them today. O oh. The court will be taking him by them today. But it will lose sense. Okay. All right. Vamos a seguir practicando esa estructura. Que ahorita quizás están preguntando por qué el verb to be, por qué el participio. Pero a medida que lo sigamos practicando va a ser más fácil eh, colocar, por ejemplo, el objeto de la oración, convertirlo al sujeto el sujeto convertirlo a object pronoun, etc. Doesn't work. Aquí está también. It would be take him to court today. Le decía, murder by the two detectives or by them. Bueno. Ok, bueno, vamos a practicar el passive voice. Segundo. Recordarles, está compuesto por el sujeto más el verb to be más um, el past participle. For example, it's a very old film. It was made. It was made in 1942. Excellent. Number two. E nowadays all all bags at airports are checked. Are checked. Next. This was painted. Was, painted. was painted by Picasso. All the instructions. Are, 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 written, are written written are written in Japanese. A man was, was, was beaten was by a shark yesterday. This dress was worn, was worn by Marilyn Monroe. By Marilyn Monroe. The pyramids were built. Were built. Were built. I forgot to turn my lights and on. I lights on and we. 
were, were, stopped. were stopped. Very good. Muy bien. Les voy a compartir otra práctica. Ok. Intenten realizarla ustedes. And when you finish, let me know, please. Can you open the link? Yes, teacher. Good. Okay, did you finish? No, no teacher, not yet. Yet. Okay.
Okay, ready. No teacher. No teacher. Okay. Okay, well, let's try to solve the exercise right now. For example, okay, Saturn rings. What it is? Where? Where? Discovered by Galileo. Yeah. The, 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 no, the film. The film. The film. Iron. Iron. Lady. No, the the mayúscula. The the film the Iron Lady is is based on the life the life of of Good. No ser la última. Mobile phone. Oh. Where? Where in oh. Invent. Invented by Apple. by Apple. Okay. Uh, due to the time, let's stop right here. And I need to take the attendance list. Yeah, I'm going to begin with Alfredo Reyes. Present teacher. Hernández Sotelo. Present teacher. Maribel Ramos. Calderón de López. Present teacher. Alvarado de Benavides. Present teacher. López González. Present teacher. Rugamas Melara. Present. Unes Mineros. Santana González. Tobar Ayala, Herrera Lucha, Alvarado Mejía, Present. Mejía Hueso, León Rivera, Present Teacher, Thank you. Castaneda Velasco, Romero Ayala, Present Teacher, Rosibel Hernández, Present Teacher, Asensio Arevalo, Molina de García. Present. López de Cabrera. Present. Excellent. Okay. 
tonight. I'll stop right here the class and see you tomorrow. God bless you and good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you. Bye. See you tomorrow. Good night. Yeah.